Hey guys, welcome back to Exotic Tea Blog. I'm back with another video. Before we get into this one, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so every single time I post, you'll be notified. And let's quickly dive into today's topic. So, Nicki Minaj clapped back at Doja Cat, and most of the dots like Trina, Cardi B, and also the dots, the dots, the dots. So, a Nicki song she put out with Future on um, Press Play, she said, um, sets the tone like their vocal coach and also this hoes they can't call her queen that's why they gotta call beyonce queen so basically this is what nikki is saying and this um i feel like she's addressing the whole trina case of trina coming to say beyonce is the, basically the queen of rap so nikki i believe she kind of tweeted this line on her twitter page and most fans didn't really catch it so i think nikki is addressing the whole trina stuff moving on from that nikki said I had to put these chickens back in their cube like to do a hole. I hear you talking, but who are you talking to? Ho gag, it's the gag. So, this is to Doja Cat, being the fact Doja Cat put out two diss tracks to Nicki Minaj on Friday. So, um, Nikki basically coming back to clock them girls, and she's like, I hear you talking. What the fuck are you talking to? Moving on from there, Nicki Minaj said, I am your label's obsession. I believe this is Cardi B and also La um, Latho and also Doja Cat because Atlantic been trying for a long time to take Nicki Minaj out and now I was here pushing Doja Cat so she could compete with Nicki Minaj. So I feel like Nicki is basically talking to um, Cardi B and also um, Latho and Doja Cat. She said, you can't be me, I'm already me, I've been saucy. They want a skinny deep so they um she's still talking to cardi b she's telling the girls y'all can't even morph into me because i'm already me and i'm being saucy so that's a good shot from nikki i expected her to come back and she collapsed back anyways y'all should let me know if you like about the song down below in the comments moving on from that early prediction fuck the club up is gonna go up to number 13 spots and also everybody's gonna be going to the top 20 so y'all should let me know if you like about this down below um this is what i was saying nikki they're now playing chess and if i was Nicki minaj i'll put out several versions of this song fuck the club up and i'll go top 10 because other people will um, be doing it but once Nicki minaj want to do y'all would say oh Nicki minaj want to put out a full album for a song but y'all if you've been doing it taylor swift does she does it every single release so i don't see no problem with that but i'm it's a very good look for Nicki minaj going that level moving on from the female rap albums with the most number one on the us items this decade pink friday 2 number one with six songs going to the um number one items bad news by megan the stallion number two and also scarflow by doja cat number one so they didn't a good look for doja and also on um, bad news but nikki doing the most so that's why i said she's the queen of rap and also to charts on itunes means um your fans are really buying and supporting the song this is why i always say these girls is don't get um they don't get the kind of support the barbs are giving to Nicki minaj moving on from there the obsession with nico time and mirage continues from delusional gang and also cardi b this um cardi b fan aka the dud came out saying this was the arms thought her album was giving no one that she's parodying so y'all should let me know if you about this down below um they're trying to say because um 21 savage album knocked out Nicki minaj album from the number one spot and also is now currently charting higher they're trying to say the album is flop and y'all be obsessing over Nicki minaj y'all be doing streaming party on 21 savage album like y'all should say the fuck his album is new definitely is gonna go number one but nikki is also gonna take that spot back mind you she stayed the longest day 30 36 days at number one spot y'all fave can never do it she beat out cardi b since the sixth day so y'all should stop being delusional and y'all being pressed and pissed about Nicki minaj because y'all ain't getting the second album from that delusional hole so y'all should stop being pressed and if y'all really want to stream something so bad y'all should stop streaming to you know average and y'all should go and stream y'all should go and stream bongos bozos be flopping not even close to 70 million streams we are we like two million dollars budget on that song we all the radio it did receive y'all be calling Nicki minaj flop but when y'all be flopping y'all want to hide your face y'all want to talk about that single just like the way y'all forget about her ish but anyways y'all should let me know if i was delusional hoes down below in the comments
Moving over to flop house, so it looks like her and DJ Khalid are now working on a project. So y'all should let me know if about this young below. She posted up a picture of her and DJ Khalid on her Instagram story, and it got the whole of the flop hole, aka the crackpots, talking about a collaboration. So y'all should let me know if about this young below. Um, to me, um, Latho and DJ Khalid putting out the collaboration. I don't think it's gonna be a hit. I also think it's mid. Latho and DJ should sit the fuck no shade to flop her her diss track in doing that well and it's so unfortunate that um her fans trying to push this narrative oh her um her bars was landing her diss track was this it was there it was that like at the end of the day flop hole is gonna do the same thing the song is sounding like put it on the trash no shade to her the song ain't giving and still unfortunately the ice spices on this track is now going viral on tiktok nobody's checking out for hers this is my whole thing with flop hole she doesn't know how to make a hit song she doesn't know how to make a bop she's just gonna come out here talking 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 and still talking to her talking about her body every other day like girl i thought you was a rapper but every time you want a sex talk it ain't that selling it not really gonna sell nobody's checking out for you again i think i will see she dump this girl and also push no money at the end of the day, flop her don't sell. Like, not like she brings back on um, the income y'all be spending on her. So her and DJ Khalid putting out a song, it's not gonna be a bop. The last time she had a song with DJ Khalid with the city flops, um, it was Bill Speed. No shade, I like GT, but the song was a flop. But anyways, y'all should let me know if you about this topic down below if you think you'll be here for that collab. Now, moving over to the industrial plastic bag, aka Cardi B. Um, she came out to confirm a uh, news by her fan page saying she got paid a million dollars for performing at the um that's um new year eve where she had that on um, freaky ass big and she also teased the distract to Nicki minaj so y'all should let me know if you about this down below i'm not believing this lies coming from this b word she ain't getting no one million dollars to perform old songs and also flop songs so y'all should stop pushing it i know she lies about people every other time but let me know if you about this topic down below like comment subscribe hit the notification bell and i'll talk to you on the next video thanks for watching